गुड मॉर्निंग क्लास फाइव हाउ आर यू ऑल चिल्ड्रन आई होप यू आर फाइन एंड यू हैव एन्जॉयड द फेस्टिवल ऑफ दीपावली आफ्टर यूर एग्जाम्स सो नाउ वी आर बैक टू द क्लासेस एंड टूडे वी विल स्टार्ट अ न्यू चैप्टर दैट इज चैप्टर नंबर फाइव नो मोर अबाउट एम एस वर्ड टू थाउजेंड सेवन you have studied about ms word you know that it is a word processor and uh, you have i think you must have used also in various occasions so i guess from second uh, from third class you are learning about ms word so let's see what all we are going to study in this class okay so the topics in this chapter are inserting clip part we will learn how to insert clip part inserting word art filling colors and give shadow effects in the shapes inserting symbols changing case means upper case and lower case then inserting picture from file inserting shapes selecting group and ungroup objects and then inserting headers and footers and applying page borders and page color so before we start the chapter as you can see that uh, this is more of a practical chapter than the uh, theoretical one so you need to watch all the videos understand the concept because uh, you need to learn about the application more than exams or numbers you need to uh, learn about the um, application software that the word is ms word is so please do watch all the videos properly and those who have system at home try to do it on your systems okay so let's start the chapter that is introduction you have already learned that ms word is a word processing application software means it is not just a simple so application software and as you have studied uh, before that uh, application software always aims at a particular work uh, but they have a target to fulfill so what is the um, purpose of ms word that it is a word processing software and uh, i usually compare this word processing thing your word processor uh, concept with the food processor we all have seen food processors at home that is mixer grinder juicer what does it do it processes the food elements okay so that way uh, in application software that ms word is the words are processed for the perfect output whether we want the output uh, in the form of essay reports application tables everything is done um many and many things are done with the word with the text so that we get the desired output it is a part of the ms office package you already know that it is a part of ms office package along with ms excel ms powerpoint ms access so it is one of the most used application of ms office package you have already studied about ms word 2007 have a look at the ms word 2007 screen in this chapter we will learn more about ms word 2007 so in this application we are going to learn about the new uh, about the screen of the ms word 2007 and this screen is more or less same in even the new versions okay so now let's see from the from top to bottom uh, this is minimize button you can see all the three buttons are there which we see in almost all the windows that is minimize maximize and close button then this whole area is ribbon in which we know different tabs and groups are there then uh, this is title bar where you can see the title of the document right now it is showing document 1 because it is not saved and when the document is saved it shows the title here along with the application's name then this is quick access toolbar means we can quickly access the various types of commands from here so this is quick access toolbar then office button in this various uh, options are there like new open save 
etcetera then uh, cursor this is cursor from here you can start typing then status bar status bar is given at the bottom okay Be because it shows the status of the document it will show you words which uh, on which page you are working then then the different types of views etc then this whole white area where you can type is not known as document area okay in uh, paint in ms paint and uh, paint it is known as what is it known as paint area right now it is known as document area okay so these are the different elements of the ms word application now let's see this computer manner you will read on your own means uh, when you are asked to move the computer document uh, equipment within the lab and not just within the lab but even at your home or wherever you are moving it you need to unhook all the equipments from the computer and avoid cable tripping okay you need to unhook just like any other device whether you are using television or um, uh, dvd player or anything you need to unhook all the equipments and you need to avoid tripping from the cable now how to insert clip art a document becomes more attractive when pictures are added to it you can insert pictures of your choice at the desired place in ms word uh, even in this normal book if we see if these pictures are not there it will become very boring so we know that uh, when pictures are added any document will become more attractive we can insert pictures of our choice and wherever we want to add it in ms word it contains uh, a ready-made picture gallery known as clip art and that consists of several categories of clip art images means the gallery which is there inside the ms word in which ready-made pictures are there we don't have to search or we don't have to draw okay so that gallery is known as clip art and it consists of several categories of clip art images the following steps are taken up in order to insert clip art let's see the um, for the steps which we need to take number one is click the insert tab on the ribbon means we will click on the insert tab it is there okay you can see this and then click clip art from the illustration groups group on the right side of the screen the clip art task pen appears okay here you can see various pictures will be visible to you okay so uh, from here you can select and then let's see what we'll do step three write the name of the clip you want in the search for box for example animals and click the go button many animals will appear you can see many animals here select any picture of your choice and click on it clip part is inserted in your document when you will click on it it will be inserted in the document like in this case it can be dragged and placed at some other place also you can resize it means we can change its place and we can change its size also okay this is how we will insert clip part in the document fine children and we will uh, i will show you this practically in the next video how you will do it now how to insert pictures a picture can also be inserted from a file in a document take the following steps how you will insert the pictures from the file means uh, you already have a file and from there you want to insert the picture click the insert tab on the ribbon click picture from the illustration group this is illustration groups group the insert picture dialog box opens as shown below select the picture from the desired location you will select the picture wherever it is stored click the insert button and thus the picture of your choice is inserted in your document means we can use ready made pictures as well as we can uh, uh, like uh, we can draw our own picture or can um, the picture we can use the picture which we have saved in the document okay so this way the picture library will be shown or you can search from here wherever your picture is stored you can uh, just like uh, you open the document 
any document same way you will search for um, that your document here and when you will go there you will insert you will click on this insert button and this is how the picture will be inserted in your document okay children so next topic how to insert word art we'll do in the next period thank you bye bye take care